Welcome back. This is episode two of me trying to acquire a billion iron ingots in modded Minecraft. I am Minecraft Phenom 08, and in between episodes, I did a little bit of mining. Uh, not very much, but now I have 51 iron ore, and I'm going to pop that in this furnace, and I'm going to start smelting. In fact, um, I'm going to make more furnaces because it's just so slow. Now we're just going to pop some of these bad boys down. We're going to bring out our coal. Split this up. Put eight a piece, give or take. And then, oh, nope, I forgot. Since mods allow coal to be cooked, when you shift click it, it goes into the top slot when you want it to go into the bottom slot. But that's okay. Okay, now we got some iron cooking. Um, what we need first is we need some buckets. Let's get a couple buckets because we need some lava. Uh, like I said in episode one, um, this next step is to get a, sm a uh, smell tree from uh, Tinker's Construct up and running. Fortunately, there's monsters outside right now, so I might have to wait to go out unfortunately uh, also unfortunately my iron pick is almost gone the iron pick that I made near the end of the last episode uh, these monsters just need to go away that's what they need to do uh, you still there still there what I really need is I need a bed. Luckily, there's a sheep right there. Let's make a shear. Because I need wool and wood and we can make a bed. Come on, three wool. Oh, look at that. Lucky. I believe that typically you'll get between one and three wool when you shear a sheep. I just happen to get pretty lucky right there. That's cool. So I got my three wool that I needed, and now I have a bed. Bam. Uh, now let's find some lava. And on my mini-map, it looks like there's lava this way. So, doo -doo -doo. let's run. We don't got time to walk around. Over meow. There's some cows. Mer. Oh, there's one bucket of lava. Well, that's kind of dumpy. There's not a great way to get. Ah, there's not a bad way. Thank you, Mr. Water. So, well, we're going to be working with one bucket of lava. Well, that's cool. I would have liked to have more, but you can't always get what you want. Yep, just one. Oh, well. Let's head back home. And, and uh, actually, we need to hunt for some sand and gravel and clay. Sand is easy, there's sand everywhere. Uh, but we will need some gravel and clay, although I believe there was some uh, gravel nearby, so that's good. We will need more shovels though, because one wooden shovel that's almost dead is not uh, exactly good. So let's make a few. Let's do four, because I need sand, gravel, and clay. I really don't want to use my iron for this, so we'll just make a bunch of shovels out of stone. Uh, let's go find us some some resources. Okay, cool. There's gravel right here. Looks like plenty of it. And. 
I would like to get just over a stack. I'd say like a stack and a half of this. Actually, a stack, stack and a half or two stacks. Because it's it's best if you can just make as much grout as possible, and grout takes gravel, sand, and clay in equal parts to make. So if we can get about two stacks of each, that'd be that'd be pretty pretty good start. And just as a point. For future reference, I'm not exactly the uh, best builder in terms of aesthetics, and I'm generally not too concerned with how things look as long as they function pretty well. And I'm gonna leave this hole right here because we can fix it later. Okay, now we have just over a stack. I'm gonna need more. Oh well. I'll find some. That will be okay. Now let's get some sand. I know I already have some sand, but I know I don't have very much, so we'll just get two, two new stacks. I will be using quite a bit of sand in the future to turn into glass, so having a little extra sand isn't going to hurt anything. Luckily, uh, even stone shovels aren't too, too slow at the at harvesting sand or dirt or gravel or clay, so shouldn't take too, too long. Let's not knock over our stuff. That would be a good start. Oh, good. I see, I see cactuses and, and sugar cane. This is why I like desert. A lot of good stuff around here. Big fan of the desert. Probably my b favorite biomes in Minecraft. Other than the lack of trees thing, they're pretty great. I especially like them because there's no rain in the desert. And that helps me out. It will help me out in the future. Okay. We're probably getting close. Yep, we're real close. Okay, that's honestly good enough. Let's... I know I saw some gravel. Let's get all this. Because sugar cane is super useful. And I'll be able to use some of it real soon. As long as I grab enough to feel comfortable, because I like to, I like to have a nice uh, growing supply. And right now I have 18, so that that should be good. Oh, gravel, 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 and clay. And if you're unfamiliar with Tinker's Construct or Minecraft in general, uh, you can generally find clay uh, in rivers. I think I see some right there. It's honestly deeper than I'd rather have it be, but we're going to try to harvest some of it anyways. Hopefully we don't drown, because that would be bad. surface. This guy can't swim very well. He's no Michael Phelps. Uh, this isn't a bad supply of clay at all. Unfortunately, it is deep. But whatever, I'll take what I can get. Okay, come on, come on, swim, swim. Really don't want to drown, but you know, what can you do? Hey, octopus, I'm sparing your life right now. Really need to be thankful. Oh. Whew. 
I could kill it, but because the ink is pretty useful, but I'm I'm gonna spare it for now. I'll come back when I need it. Swim. How much clay do we have? Stack and a half. That's not bad. Yeah, let's finish this off. Okay, so that'll be stack and a half. Stack plus uh, 40. I see some more. That's good. The good thing about clay is one block equals four clay, so makes things a little easier. Okay, I really need to not do this. Stop drowning. And while you're drowning, eat these cherries. Because logic. I believe I have enough clay. Now I need some sand. Still need sand. Not sand, gravel. Good memory right there. Since they're around, I might as well grab some cactuses. Because cactuses are always useful. You know what I have? I know where I can find a little gravel. Uh, hopefully it's enough. If it's not, we can always grab more. This is a really good spawn. I really like this spawn point. Sometimes I get maps where uh, there is no desert in sight, and I have to look and look and look, and it's a pain. Sometimes I even settle for non-desert locations, which is sad. I really like the desert. Right now this will do, though. I There's gravel down here. And I have a shovel, just over one shovel. Good. Good. There seems to be some gravel down here. Wrong thing. Oh yeah, this is nice. Nice. Nice! I'm just finding everything I want. And I actually have enough gravel right now, but we'll get a little extra just because. Because it's right here. It's really easy. And then we'll mine up the copper and iron, and we will... Oh shoot, you know what I don't have? I don't have aluminum. You know what, I can find some aluminum. I only need a few ingots of aluminum. And if I remember right, aluminum is found around, it's found really high up. Oh my goodness. This is what happens when you have a sticky keyboard. Okay, aluminum. <laughs> I just had oh no, darn it's right in front of me moron yeah it's found high up let's go to level 50 and carve ourselves out a little mine shaft or a little offshoot i should say oh shoot I don't think this pick's going to make it. I really probably only need like two alumina. I don't know. I don't even know that I need two. I might only need one. Well, that's not cool. Now I have to make another pick. Uh, 
Should I go ahead and use iron? I don't really... Yeah, I found some iron, so I have a little spare iron. Let's go ahead. Okay, back to it. Back to it. Come on, aluminum. Aluminum is definitely less common than like copper or iron, but hopefully we'll find some real soon. Yes, 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 yes. Found three. That is plenty. I am happy with that. Let's go back. Okay, if I, w if I was smart earlier, what I would have done is I would have made my grout and popped it into my furnaces. Unfortunately, that didn't happen. So, what we can do now is we can make some grout. And we will split this up. We have four stacks of grout. We have four furnaces. That's pretty, pretty good. Now we can toss some of this extra stuff in here. Uh, oh, nope, 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 nope. I saw a creeper. It's not what you want to see. Okay, I need to also smelt a little bit of sand. Let's see, I need a tank. I might only need one, but I'm going to smelt up eight. Because I can. And then let's get rid of some stuff. I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need you. Definitely don't need you. Let's pop the shears in here. Spare shovel. Good. Okay. Okay. Uh, in the book, Materials in You, which you will get at the beginning when you first spawn into a world, you will get this book that will tell you how to make a smell tree. Um, typically, I make a simple three by three smell tree, but I believe you can actually make smaller smell trees now. Um, but let's make some basic things here. Typically I have two drains because I have, I use a casting basin and uh, I don't know what the other thing's called. Casting table maybe? Yeah, casting table. I generally build both. Uh, I need some glass. What I really need is I need these furnaces to go faster. That's what we really need. Good. Yes, that'll work. That'll work well. Really want to get this thing built. Uh, okay, cool. Um, what I need, I need four of these guys because I am going to step, skip straight ahead to the tool forge. I guess. Yeah, let's use. What I need is some patterns. Good. Now we get a stencil table, crafting station. Uh, part builder. Should we have any wood? 
we do. I wonder if this will make more chest. Nope. Good. 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 Pattern chest. Actually, I think that's everything. But I would like to build. one of these guys as well. Oh shoot, did I not? Yeah, there we go. Okay, now we have everything I need, except for the tool forge, but we can build that really shortly. Okay, let's see if I remember how to make this. It's like that, cool. Okay, now we need to pick out a spot to have all this stuff. And since over here is flat and nice, oh, it's gonna be right here. Okay, we can put... I don't know how I wanna do this. Let's just do this. <laughs> Okay, that will work. Okay, we will be making a hammer uh, as our first thing. So we need to build a hammer. You need two, uh, two large plates, a hammerhead, and a tough tool rod. So I have the hammerhead pattern, and then I need the tough tool rod pattern, and I need the plate pattern. There we go, got it all. We also need location for our smeltery, and that will be right here, I believe, would be a good spot. So let's set up what we have. We really need a weed whacker. Okay, I like to put my casting table closer to where you generally are. I can slap down these guys. And hopefully, since we spent all that time uh, out there setting that up, hopefully we have enough seared bricks to continue. And it kind of looks like we do. Uh, I need a tank to put my lava in. Then I didn't do that right. Try that. Okay. Thank you very much. And when you can, if you'll notice right now, this is not lit up or anything. It's just black. When you correctly build a smell tree, it will. Okay. Why is it doing that? will show fire here so we know that it's correctly built shoot i already had that now i'm gonna throw in some lava uh honestly i don't remember what aluminum aluminum brass is okay it is one part copper three parts aluminum so we'll throw in three of these and one of these and that should get us some aluminum brass uh, unfortunately, I threw away all my cobble. That was... I should have probably kept some of it. Oh, well. Whatever. We'll do all right. We will do all right. Okay, cool. Uh, we'll make a hammerhead. Let's just make this easy tough tool rod and then a plate and we need to make casts of all of this stuff oh yeah oh yeah I only needed like three ingots or something like that three or six and I can't remember which now but I have eight which is great 
Like I said, some people like to make clay casts. I don't just because it's not that hard to go straight to uh, aluminum brass casts or gold casts if that's your thing. Nope. Wrong, wrong, wrong. But, okay, now we need to make a bunch of bronze. And we need 12. I'm going to make uh, the head and both plates out of bronze initially. So we need uh, what, 8 times 3 because each part is 8. We need 24. 24 ingots. Um, and I'm actually going to make the handle out of wood to begin with. Because it's, uh, its trait is actually all right. So we don't even need that. I do want a chest out here though. So let me get some wood. I thought I had some wood left. Yeah, I do. I'm just blind, it's okay. And then I like to just have a chest for some spare materials for my cast and stuff. I won't be needing that. I need to just throw a bunch of stuff in. I, I think it's a 3 to 1 ratio, copper to 10, but let me check before I make a dumb mistake or something. Yeah, it's 3 to 1, so that's good. So 24 divided by 4 would be 6, so we need 6 times 3 parts copper, 18 copper, and... 6, 10, because 6 times 1. Okay. I really hope this lava holds out. I'm really excited for this hammer thing. I really want it to be hammer time. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, now with the part builder, what we can do is we can't make a wooden tool rod because we don't have wood. But we have some over here, so whatevs. Uh, see, problem solved. All problems are solvable. And now we slap our wood in. Nope, don't want that. Okay, cool. Okay, we got bronze. And hopefully, hopefully this thing won't be too temperamental. I've had some issues with tinker, with the smell tree and uh, the 1.2 version of the direwolf pack. It, it uh, crashing the client, but not the server. So hopefully we don't have any issues there. I guess I should get this ready. Nice. Okay, we got... We got our head, now we need our two plates. Did I miscal- I'm thinking I miscalculated. Oh well, whatever. We're gonna have extra bronze in here. I mean, that's not a big deal. That's not a problem at all. We have extra, cool. So. That is good. We have a head, we have a tough rod, and we have two plates. Let's slap this bad boy together. Nice. Look at that. I know it's nothing to, it's not a great hammer, but it's a good hammer to begin with. And it looks like it's a uh, wrapping up point. So uh, we mined just a little bit. We set up a smell tree and we got ourselves a hammer. And next episode, I'm going to set up a more permanent, uh, what I call a mine shaft. And well, it's been fun. Hopefully I'll see you next time. This is... Minecraft Phenom 08.